Welcome back from the bench, everybody. It's always Eric, and today we're back with another hobby box of 2022-2023 Series 1. Haven't opened this in a while. I think the last box I opened was uh, back on release week. I want to open up six boxes on the channel. If you want to go back and check them out, you can do that. Uh, just check the playlist, but it should be there. Here we go. Um, also, Happy New Year. Merry Christmas to everybody. Essentially, I got my grading reveal in. I did the mystery tins and stuff. And then all my time has been spent, uh, obviously, with Christmas, all that good stuff. But I also had to clean up uh, down here, which is my basement, which is where I record and everything else. Uh, and all my card stuff that you can't see behind the camera and whatnot. Uh, I had to clean all of that up because um, we had family coming over and stuff. So that spent a lot of my time. It gets away from you, especially when, you know, last few years. I'm the only one that comes down here. Girlfriend stays upstairs. I go, come down here. It's a good little mixture. So uh, here we go, though. 24 packs, 8 cards per pack. Looking for hobby exclusives like... Clear cut, exclusives, high gloss, etc. So let's get this going. Uh, we got Jack Eichel, Clayton Keller. Starting off with the Young Guns canvas. This is what you want to see. Alex DeBrinkat and a Young Guns. Man, I'm telling you, Series 1 this year is really going to give uh, Series 2 from last year a run for its money with me because, jeez. Uh, yeah, there we go. First pack, Matty Beneers, Young Guns, Canvas. I was thinking, like, well, maybe it's Maselli because I literally just uh, packed up a Maselli. Uh, the Maselli and that Kent Johnson over there, they're both going back to upper deck uh, for quality control. This one might too because there, it looks like there's a nice little dent right there. So I'm probably going to message them about that. So uh, they have actually been pretty good. They I sent them a request uh, for the Kent Johnson. They were actually off the Black Friday blasters and stuff. You guys watched that video, video of me opening up those. Um, they, were, they were worse. Like one of the corners was all jacked up and dented in. The other one was... Same thing, but they took care of that. But there we go. Matty Beneers. I hadn't hit that Young Guns uh, canvas yet. Start this off right. Deals Hoglander, Drake Batherson, and Jason Robertson. Got a Platinum Retro rookie of him for sale if anybody wants. Instead of like 75, I believe, maybe 150. Uh, it's a purple one, whatever uh, that one is. But if anybody wants, always, if you guys are ever looking for cards to see me open something, uh, let me know. This one will probably, I'll probably send back to Upper Deck uh, see or see if they will from the little dent. Um, just because I think Maddie Beniers could be pretty good. And canvases are nice because canvases grade well if you watch my last grading video. So uh, Tristan Jerry got hurt in the Winter Classic. Vanacek, Andreas Johansson, our first young gun. The Blue Jackets, it's a right winger, so not Ken Johnson. Carson Meyer, this is my Ian Mitchell uh, for this year. Carson Meyer, I've hit a lot of, there's a lot of Blue Jackets in this, but I'm telling you, I've, Carson Meyer might be the one I hit the most. Connor Murphy, Mike Hoffman, and Owen Tippett. Um, obviously, there's a lot of things going on right now. It was a whirlwind of a night to watch sports. I'm recording this. Uh, late, where is this, the second, this is Monday, I believe, this day was Monday, um, so obviously, you had, yeah, it was Monday, uh, you had the World Juniors game, Connor Bedard, ridiculous, we'll get into that in a second, but uh, shout outs to the Bills player, uh, obviously going to hospital, if it gets released, what happened to him, or anything like that, um, as the night goes on, once again, I'm recording this, at this point, all I know is he's in the hospital, uh, everything else, scary times, and it kind of puts into perspective for some of these athletes and what they kind of put their, what they risk doing all this stuff. So uh, debut dates, this is Jamie Drysdale. Sorry to get like a little, you know, soft and and uh, you know emotional about that, but it's it's just scary what some of these guys deal with and the thought of you know playing that game after you see a guy that's unconscious, CPR, all that other stuff. 
just scary, scary stuff. Um, so, uh, Joel Armia, David Pasternak, Dylan Strom, playing pretty well this year. Another debut date, this is Karel Vajmalka. I think I actually nailed the name of that. I think it's Vaj- Vajmalka. I think I just butchered it at that time. Ryan Johansson, Yoki Haru, Sean Dersey, and Olivier. Um, so I'm pretty sure his last name is... It's not Kylington. I can't remember how, how to pronounce it. I'm forgetting right now. So we're not going to go through that road. Uh, Nico Dawes, Morgan Riley, Cam Fowler, next young gun for the Pittsburgh Penguins, right winger, Valtteri Pustinin. There we go. He is Finnish. Sorry for any of the Finnish uh, World Junior players. 99, so... Not quite a same young buck as some of them, but essentially that'd be the same age that Kaprizov came in the NHL. Out. Anyways, I digress. Um, but yeah, it's it's just a scary and having idiots like Skip Bayless. How Skip Bayless has a job to just yell at a TV and nobody actually is like, oh, I like Skip Bayless. I nobody's ever said they like Skip Bayless. Nobody. No one's like, yeah, I like I love his takes. Man, I tune in just to watch Skip. Skip so smart, blah, blah. No, he just ha- says stupid things in a microphone and people listen to him. Like, if you're going to have a hot take, you should actually believe it. Skip doesn't believe anything he says anymore. He's just a robot that just says all that stuff. And his tweet was just so stupid. I hope I hope FS1 lets him go. Probably won't because he'll, you know, BS his way through it. But there was a lot of backlash on him tonight. Uh, Vegas Golden Knights, Jonathan Marshall so, and the Blue Dazzlers. I think Dazzler's looking pretty good this year. Uh, I do, once again, uh, I think I mentioned, I don't know if I mentioned this last time. I ordered two boxes. Now, they are on not from locally, uh, but I ordered two boxes of Marvel Metal. We'll see what the prices are locally. Um, they were just a really good deal online, and you never know. I know they aren't guaranteed an auto this year, which they were last year, um, but I got them for like 180 a box. Uh, from 401 games so they might not be here right on release day if it depends on the prices locally i might grab one another one but i do have two of those coming also uh should be in the next i think it's like next week uh that those are coming in so uh, honor roll roman yossi but anyways lots of stuff for the channel i said i hadn't just everything else going on over the last uh two weeks hadn't got a chance to uh you know, posted a little bit on social media, but to sit down and do the videos, once again, clean up the area. I had all this packed up. So, uh, Jared McCann, Jacob Truba, and a French variant of Pavel Francouz. There we go. Still the backup over there in Colorado. Definitely a, a rougher season so far to start for Colorado. I think they'll turn it around, obviously, but as of right now, I think Edmonton's ahead of them by like a point. With like uh, two games in hand. Or sorry, two games. They've played two more games than we have. Um, but I'm not really worried about it. Like I said, we're just getting some guys back and healthy. Ryan Donato. Roman Yossi. Another honor roll. This is Sid the Kid. Couldn't pull it off in the Winter Classic this year. Spencer Knight. Kale McCarr at the very end. Also, I want to show off... Uh, Hopefully, let me know in the comments what you guys, uh, what was your favorite PC pickup of the year. If you don't know what PC is, it's personal collection, a card that you really like. Let me know in the comments what it was. This might be mine. Uh, for a lot of people, nobody would really care about this. But for me, it's an Ivan Barbershop. I posted on Instagram. This is out of the cup. Rookie. Nice four color patch. This is the shorter print. This is a gold. This is 11 out of 24. Such a clean auto. Like he usually does his auto pretty good, but that's my might be my favorite PC uh, for hockey. That might be it for for the 2022 season. I uh, got it right at the end of the year for a pretty good deal. I would say there's never never hurts to send an offer to somebody. Worst case they do is just counter you. Uh, this guy I sent a got that for 50 bucks actually. Here we go. We got uh, Anton Lindell. Having a down year, just like everybody else in Series 2 from last year. Uh, but there's this rookie retrospective. Um, you know, it doesn't hurt to send somebody off. I sent them off for 50 bucks. 
He accepted it. Canadian free shipping. Add the tax. It's like under 60 bucks. I was like doing backflips. <laughs> That's like one of the greatest deals I've ever got. And for it being a PC card, it's even better. Uh, Kale Clegg, next young gun for the Buffalo Sabres is Jack Quinn. <laughs> Jack Quinn, what a box. Jack Quinn for the Buffalo Sabres. Former Team Canada member, Jack Quinn. Buffalo Sabres fan. They have a pile of guys in the uh, in the system ready to come up over the next couple of years. Jack Quinn being one of them. Obviously, Tage Thompson, the the hobby darling right now. Uh, him, uh, one of the guys in the middle there. Jason Robertson, probably the biggest gainers of the year, I would say. Uh, backdrop of the day, by the way. We got Kent Johnson, by the way, selling right now for about fifteen twenty dollars uh, Canadian uh, currently. You got Pitor Kochetov. I actually talked about him in the preview video. If you guys want to go back and check that out, just to learn some of the, about the young guns from this crop, there's a video for that before the product got released. Uh, talked about him, saying he could be a sneaky guy just because his numbers were pretty good last year and everything else. Lo and behold, he's playing really well. And then we got Matt Boldy, who's he's like 70 bucks right now uh, for his regular young gun. Once again, pretty good overall. He's got the Kirill Kaprizov around him, so not too bad. Uh, Sean Couturier, John Carlson, Mitchie Marner, and Philip Deneau, former Moncton Wildcat Philip Deneau. So, yeah, it's, uh, it's not the craziest crop of all time. There's no, like, super high end for this. I guess Matty Beniers would be, like, your hopeful uh, Kochetov, Owen Power, but he's a defenseman, right? Matt Boldy has the potential, but you know, it's, I don't think you have a uh, Connor Bedard in here, which we'll talk about in a second. Uh, Thatcher Demko, um, center of attention. This is Sebastian Ajo, uh, Kyle Connor, Josh Bailey, Capo Kakinen, and a Alex Nadelkovich. So, um, once again, before I move on to this, shouts out to the Buffalo Bills player. Like I said, scary, scary thing uh, when you see that stuff. I got kind of on the, on my tangent with Skip Bayless, how he's an idiot and should be fired. Anyways, it, it is what it is. Um, obviously, Team Canada happened. You know, Team Canada only played a couple pre-tournament games. Buff Blue Jackets, again, it's another right winger. So here's the other guy, Trey Fix Wolanski. If you get the Buffalo or the Columbus Blue Jackets in a break, you're probably going to walk away with a card. It might not be Ken Johnson, but, man, there's enough. Carson Meyer, uh, Wolanski, there's enough of them. Um, yeah, locally around me, like I said, Halifax and Moncton had the World Junior. It's still going on, obviously. Connor Bedard putting on a show. Um, I lost my mind at the overtime goal for Connor Bedard. Uh, undresses the entire stadium. I was joking with a buddy. I said, I think he deked everybody from uh, from Nova Scotia all the way to back to home to BC. So, uh, nope, I thought it was a canvas. Nope, nope. It's a diving Dean himself, former Halifax Moosehead, Nikolai Ehlers, and Evgeny Kuznetsov. So, it's um, he's just, the kid's a real deal. I don't... I don't know what his young gun's gonna start at. It's gonna be a thousand dollars right off the hop. A thousand dollars. Could you believe that? Like that would be believable, right? Series one next year, he comes out, thousand bucks. See the same price as Connor McDavid for the first little bit for sure. But like, what does his four go to? Portraits. There we go. Another Sid. Should they had a ninety-nine of this. That was another big hit that I had in the uh, first week opening videos. But, yeah, it's – Connor Bedard is – the kid is ridiculous. So skilled. Everyone I've talked to that was uh, – had the opportunity to go to some of the Halifax games to watch him play said, like, it's – he's the best player on the ice. And, once again, he's 17 years old. Um, it's it's going to be crazy to see what the hobby does around him. Trevor Zegras. Talked about him the other day, buddy, too. Kid must have a hard life. Good looking guy, young, you know, one of the faces of the league, everything else, living down in California. 
Like, gotta gotta be a hard life for that kid, right? Um, but yeah, Bedard, like, what is where does he go? You know, everyone's gonna start tanking for that kid. You know, I obviously <laughs> the Ducks stink, Chicago stinks, Arizona stinks. Like, there's a lot of teams that stink, and they're all gonna be hoping that their uh, ping pong ball, you know, falls the right way so they can get that guy. Zub, Corrali, Daniel Sprong, and we got a clear cut young gun. Okay. Not one of the three out back. This is for the Kings. Is this Jordan Spence? Oh. Oh, it teased me. I was hoping it was going to be former Moncton Wildcat Jordan Spence. It's Jacob. Mover, 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 Mover. I don't know how to say his last name. We got Jacob here. So we're hoping for Jordan Spence. That's, I guess we'll put him up. We'll put him up. We'll take it on Jack. We'll put up the clear cut. It's a cool hit, but for the PC, I was hoping that was going to be Jordan Spence. But uh, Tanner Pearson. Kahara and Nikas. So, that's a shame. And I got all jacked up with that. Uh, I thought maybe this was... I shouldn't say was going to go my way. Obviously, I've had a very good opening so far. Uh, Bovillier, Carlson, Lucas Raymond's finally starting to heat up a little bit. For the Flyers, Linus Sandine. We're in the Connor Bedard special there. Plastic cage. My brother rocked one of those. He was playing back in the day. Loved it. Thought it was the greatest thing ever. Everybody else has a steel bucket, you know, steel cage going on. No, brother had the plastic one. Trying to show everybody up. I was a goalie. Didn't have that opportunity. Just rock what I got. Uh, Sharon Govich, Verana, Gabe, eventually going to come back. Going to be a big help, I think. And this rookie retrospective. This is Jonathan Dallin. He's over in Sweden, I think, or something like that. I don't think he's over. I don't think he's in the NHL anymore. Svechnikov, Jesper Bratt, Nylander, and a Jamie Drysdale again. So, no, it's, uh, I think Connor Bedard, once again, that kid has everything going for him. He's got the speed. He's got the hands. He's got the moves, the poise, the shot, the passing. Like, he's got everything, you know. The only thing you could really say is like, okay, it'd be nice if he was like two inches taller. If he can crack like the six feet mark, that'd be awesome. But he's still so young. Uh, next, young gun for the Seattle Kraken. Is this going to be a double Matty Beneers? Okay, I'm okay with it not being Jordan Spence as a clear cut young gun, okay? Like. If you guys are wondering what I'm doing, I'm just taking for like nicer cards. I usually take my top loader and I take my little box cutter knives. If your kids don't use the box cutter knives, please. Um, but I usually do it so I, it's just nicer for the corners so they don't catch, so they slide in easier. But this one too got it. A little chunk. Yeah, I think that's chunks at the top. Little snake bites at the top there, but okay, we're going double Matty Beneers in the background. I Matt Boldy was the one that was following me around at the start of this when I first opened it. Uh, out of seven boxes I opened, because I opened one for a buddy, I hit three, three or f no, I hit four Matt Boldies, regular young guns, and a canvas, I believe. Wild. Uh, Darnell Nurse, Jacob Silverberg, Dante Fabro, and Mackenzie Weger. So that's a. <laughs> I was literally saying before that I didn't want to open this product until the price went down. And the, these have this was like a buck fifty, I think, with tax and everything. Uh, maybe a little bit more, one fifty five, maybe. I can't remember what I paid for it. Uh, but I was kind of saying like, you know, I don't know if I'm going to open this until it drops down to like one twenty, one fifteen, or something like that. Canadian, just because, like, you know, it's hard to make your money back no matter what you're opening. Um, but, you know, 
you just don't have the chance really to make your money back. I think I made my money back on this one. So, uh, Jake Muzzin, it's true. A doughty and defense mechanisms. Remember when I thought that was like a case hit or something. Okay, Drew Doughty, uh, <laughs> Brandon Hagel, Jake Ansel, Ovi, and Nico Heischer. So, Ovi's going to do it, by the way. Ovi's going to break the goal record. Another hat trick the other night. It's wild, but I said at the end of the day, getting back to where I was at, Con Bedard, the kid's a real deal. Uh, but like I said, let me know in the comments what you think his young gun is going to be at when it first gets released. Regular canvas. This is Tom Wilson. I think we're going to finish off with a couple regular canvases here. But I think it's going to be like a thousand bucks. I think it's going to be the same price as a Conor McDavid, which is wild to think. But all the hype that's going to be around him, after, especially after all this World Juniors hype uh, and all everything that's happened, you know, even I don't know what obviously the final result of this tournament's going to be. But the way, he, the way he's breaking every record and he's putting up goals and he's got the highlight reels and he's got everything, I think, I would be, like I said, I think that was much of where it starts. I think it goes down, but I, don't, I wouldn't be surprised if it's like a $500 plus dollar young gun uh, every day of the week, uh, even once it kind of settles, which is, once again, wild to think about. Miro Haskinen, TJ Oshi, Justin Falk, Another canvas. This is a Josh Bailey. My clear cut hit himself, Josh Bailey. It's not who you want to hit for a clear cut auto, by the way. It's Josh Bailey. And final pack. What an opening. Thank you guys for, uh, for all for watching. If you haven't yet, like and subscribe. Uh, there is a card show in Moncton Saturday the 21st, I think it is. Whatever the Saturday is of this month, uh, around the 21st. Uh, I'll put the thing here. There, there's the poster. You see it? Perfect. Awesome. Great. Okay. There's the poster. Uh, I'll be set up there. If anybody wants to come uh, stop by, say hi. I'm usually doing the card show vlog. I'll, once again, as always, I'll be set up. So, uh, Ryan Hartman, Michael Matheson, Freddie Anderson, Jack Roslevic, and finishing off with Nate Dogg himself. Didn't get that. Uh, that walk off tonight for the Avalanche, unfortunately against the Golden Knights, but it's fine. It is what it is. Uh, Pavel and Frank Hughes, Justin Smalt, and a Timo Meyer to finish it off. So, what a way to kick off the new year! Uh, what a way to kick off 2023. Uh, the two Maddie Veneers hit the clear cut young gun. I, yeah, I don't really know if you could ask for a whole lot better. Obviously, like a clear cut and exclusive of like one of the, you know, big guys, I guess, but like I'll take two Matty Veneers, uh, young guns, uh, that that'll, that'll do. So, uh, hopefully once again, everyone has a great rest of their day and for Eric and from the bench, we'll talk to you guys later. Bye guys.